Do not sit there like, oh I don't feel like it today. I don't feel like it tomorrow. Feel like it. Do it. Force yourself. Do not torture yourself. That's how people get blocked. Don't think about the sentences, think about the story. Write the story down. Don't set out to write a good thriller. Set out to write a number one thriller. If you're going to write a bestseller, it's got to work for a lot of people. Everything you write should be moving your story forward. I need to feel as involved as I want the reader to feel. You want your readers to have strong feelings about your characters. The more you know about, the more likely you are to combine things to make an idea that's striking. With respect to characters, you want things that really dig deep and say a lot very very quickly, to get us interested in the person. It's all right to put the weight of the world on your shoulders sometimes, if you know how to take it off. I guess I write four or five hours a day, but I do it seven days a week. It's very disciplined, yes, but it's joy for me. Nobody buys a book that they don't pick up. You gotta put something out there that gets their attention and gets them curious. In my opinion, one of the biggest secrets of suspense is setting up questions that the readers must have answered. If you love something let it go. If it comes back it's yours. This time I wouldn't forget him. Because I couldn't ever forgive him, for breaking my heart twice. A friend of mine once defined love as finding someone you can talk to late into the night. Here's a freebie, don't play poker with a kid who can read minds. The funny thing about facing imminent death is that it really snaps everything else into perspective. Is it possible that you can love someone more than you love life itself, and yet you're still never going to know for sure everything he's thinking? Speed never killed anyone. It's suddenly becoming stationary. That's what gets you. If this was what life was like without words, a life of doing, not just talking. I just might be willing to give them up forever. The greatest thing in the world is to know how to belong to someone else. When it's true, when it's right, love can give you the kind of joy that you can't get from any other experience.